Are you looking to send automated replies with Gmail? Well, Gmail offers canned responses, so you can set up a template response and any emails that match your search criteria are sent that specific response automatically and immediately. There are however few problems with Gmail canned responses. The biggest problem is that you can only send canned responses to new and incoming email. There's no option for you to send replies to emails that are already in your mailbox. Gmail canned responses can contain only text. You can't have images or attachments in your responses. The other problem is that canned responses are sent immediately, so the recipient will know that it's an automatic response and not written by a person. Email Studio, a new Gmail add-on includes an autoresponder. It imposes no such limitations. You can easily set up responders inside Gmail just like canned responses, but the best part? You can respond to both old and new incoming messages in your Gmail. Before we get started, if you haven't done so already, please go to emailstudio.pro and install the email studio for Gmail add-on. Okay, so here I am in my Gmail inbox. So the first thing I'll do is write a template response. So our company has a product and whenever people send us an email to inquire about this product, we will send them this template response. looks good so if i go to my gmail inbox now and uh, i open a message in my inbox now i can see the email studio icon in the right sidebar if i open email studio i can choose email responder from the list of available modules here i'll add a new rule the idea behind responder is simple you specify a search criteria and any emails that match the search criteria, whether old or new, are sent your specified response. Now let's say for this example, I only want to look for messages that contain the word document studio in the subject. And I can also use advanced search operators in Gmail. So I can say that I only want to respond to messages that I have received in the last 15 days. So I'll use the newer than search operator. Next I will specify the Gmail draft that should be sent when messages match the search query. Now if you don't see your draft in this drop down, please click this refresh button and the list would be updated automatically. Okay, so the rule is ready and I can hit the save button to activate this rule. But before I do that, I would like to test if I have set up my search rule correctly or not. So for that, we have this preview option. I can hit preview and Gmail will show me a list of all messages that currently match my search rule. This looks good. I hit save and the rule is activated. Now the autoresponder is running in the background and it will reply to all the matching emails once every hour. However, if there are any emails in your mailbox that require an urgent response, you can press the run button to manually run this specific autoresponder rule. When the autoresponder runs, it adds a specific label to your messages that have been responded so that it doesn't process them again in the next run.